Oh, bugger, now it's pausing. What's going on? Oh, hi, it's recording now. Um, shit. Hi. Welcome to... Welcome to Ben and Nathan's assignment. Um, Nathan's not with me right now, he's behind the camera. But in the next 10 minutes or so, we're going to interview Jan Waters, bass player with Dr. Schmeg, and Tim Kiedis, lead singer of Dr. Schmeg. Unfortunately, we couldn't interview the drummer or the guitarist. They're both incredibly boring individuals anyway, but um, they're unavoidable. Unavoidably, oh fuck, I'll try that again. Hi, my name's Ben, Nathan's behind the camera, watch the video. Oh, shit. This will be the bit for just after the credits. Oh, well, or do you want me to have another go at the intro? The proper yeah, intro? Do a proper intro. Okay, here we go. I know, oh, I'm trying, just regaining my composure. <clears throat> Hi, and welcome to my private hell. Hi, and welcome to Ben and Nathan World. <laughs> I'm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hi and welcome to Ben and Nathan's world. <laughs> it's worth its weight in gold, you know. <laughs> it's worth its weight in gold. Hi, welcome to Ben and Nathan's world. Party on, Nathan. Party on, Ben. <laughs> all right. Yeah. Woo! Woo! Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well. All right, all right. All right. Well. Okay. Yeah. Cool. All right. Now, um, we're in Nathan's bedroom right now because I have to share mine with my fiance and his is albeit a bit cooler. We have sparked it up with a few. Uh, by the way, we want to say at this point, we do not accept product endorsements of any kind. We will not sell out. But right about now, I feel like a Diet Coke. Yeah. No, seriously. We're going to try this again. <clears throat> no, bugger it. We'll keep going. Okay, now this is Nathan and my assignment. Uh, I hope you do enjoy it. That we've, that we've actually put a lot of thought into this. You might think this is a bit haphazard or whatever, but hey, pfft, that's the way we function. So sit back and relax and enjoy as we interview two hard-working members of a rock and roll band in Launceston, Dr. Schmeg. Tim is like the fire and, and, and Jan is like the water. So they sort of complement each other. And uh, no, no, the fire in the eyes. No, fuck it. We'll try this again sometime later. I've talked for too long. Fuck it. We'll edit this. Okay, let's play this back and see how it looks. What are you doing? Um, <clears throat> when I first met uh, Tim, I was drunk actually, I was DJing at the Lonnie Hotel, he was barman there, and he actually gave me a Bloody Mary but didn't put the vodka in it and charged me for it, and that, ever since then we've developed a good uh, association, a good friendship, this is going back about three years. He used to come around a lot, and uh, this is before he became even a musician as such, he was busking for a while in the streets. And, making little bits and pieces of money here and there and everywhere. But uh, then he formed a band about ooh, 10 months ago or something like that called Due Back Sunday. I suppose it's piss take of Don't Come Monday, Judy Ford's old band. Anyway, that band soon became Dr. Schmeg with Tim Holzman, now Tim Kiedis. On lead vocals, Jan Waters on bass, Shane Davis on lead and rhythm guitar and Mr. Tim Chuck Manson on the old drum kit. They think that they've come a long way. They, a long way they've come. No, they've come a long way since their humble beginnings, and they're not very humble anymore. They played a festival crowd of about 2,000 people at the Bridport Pub New Year's Eve. They've been going from strength to strength. Just recently, they won. When? They won. They won the Coca-Cola Battle of the Bands competition in Hobart and won themselves a recording contract, although they'd already actually recorded a CD. So Coca-Cola agreed to instead press more CDs instead of recording them as well. So in about four weeks' time, about the end of April, you will see Dr. Schmeg's debut album, Eloquent, in the shops, in the stores, big CD launches, everything. 
And just remember one thing, when you see the CD, look for my name on the back of the cover. Next up we have Jan Waters, bass player with Dr. Schmeg. He's only been playing bass for around two years now, but he's already a well accomplished. Accomplished. <clears throat> so good? All right. Good. How's my nipple? Good? Can you get that? Is it good? Good. Okay. Good. Good nipple. All right. Here we are in suburbia. Seems like a quiet. Oh, hello, Mr. Waters. How are you today? This is an unrehearsed intro. <laughs> There's Mr. Yarn Waters. Can you see? Can you get that? Can you get that? There's Mr. Yarn Waters. Oh, we've come to interview you, Mr. Waters. Something about some shonky used cars you've been selling. We're from the investigators. It wasn't you. What was that? It's not your mini? <laughs> this is the home shopping channel. This mini can be yours. <laughs> if the price is right. We're going to go in. We're going to come along and see Yarn now. So we're just going to go for a wander, okay? Or just going to... Whenever you're ready. Yeah, keep going. Okay. Here we are in suburbia, as you see. Nothing but houses around you. A red car. Lots of red cars in suburbia. That's cool. That's cool. Hi. Bye. 